So for those of you that are seriously considering purchasing this enclosed mobility scooter, um, I'm going to give you guys some websites and some information on how to go about purchasing this. But before I do that, um, again, it's called a Q-Runner enclosed mobility scooter, and it is not a mini car. It is a mobility scooter that is meant to be driven on a bike lane or a sidewalk only. Um, it has a... Fifth, excuse me, 30 mile charge. It's electric. You just plug it into the wall and you charge it that way. Um, it has a, the top speed is 15 miles per hour. Um, again, it is not meant to be driven fast. It is literally just to drive on a bike lane or sidewalk. Um, anyone can purchase this, but the majority of people that get this are um, elderly people or disabled people. Give you guys the inside real quick. Um, it has space for three people. Um, it has a main driver's seat. It uh, seats a mobility scooter. It's a scooter on the inside. It has the handlebars. Um, it has the lights, the blinker lights, the um, bright lights for the front. It has a reverse. And when you go backwards on the screen, it has a rear view camera that pops up. Um, it has a Bluetooth radio. My husband connected my phone to it um, yesterday, so that was pretty cool. I could listen to my music now. Um, what else? It has an alarm. It has a windshield wiper. It has two doors. Um, and it has roll-up windows. And yes, they are glass windows. Um, it has a little sunroof. It has a window in the back. And again, it has a bench seat. So you can fit two people back there. And it does come with seat belts. So that's pretty neat. Um, let's see. And that's pretty much it for the mobility scooter. Hi you guys, inside the scooter. Um, so I wanted to tell you guys uh, real quick about my journey with this whole scooter. Um, it took about a year and two months from the time I started researching it online to the time it came to my house. So it took a long while and that's mainly because I had to go through um, all these websites. Um, there's a lot of scammers out there so you have to be careful. So I'm gonna give you guys um, the three web, excuse me, the six websites that I found that are legit. I ran them through the Better Business Bureau, so they're legit companies. Um, but before I do that, I wanted to let you guys know this scooter is called a Q Runner Mobility Scooter, and there's a company that's called Green Transporters that makes these in China. Now these are the legit company that like mass produces these scooters, so they're like only ones that's why um it's a lot to ship them here and everything but anyway um i suppose lady that i spoke to last year when i was first researching the scooter again the company is called green transporters and they're from china um she told me that they're the only ones who make this scooter but there's a lot of other companies that buy them and like um basically sell them as something else so they call them something else but it's the same scooter they just have different names so when i was doing my research about this particular scooter i was a little confused because when i was doing my research i found six different ones that look exactly the same but they had six different names so when i um asked the lady that she told me okay well the original one is called a q runner mobility scooter um but there's lots of other ones out there that are named something else but they're, they are a cue runner. Uh, they're just like, I guess, like the generic version. Um, but I'm not exactly sure if they all have the same thing that this one does. I just know the real, like the original brand name one is called a Q runner mobility scooter. Um, so I'm just giving you guys the information that I was given. So, um, like I said, the one that I have is called a Q runner and it's from the Green Transporters Company. There's another one that's called an E runner. There's another one that's called a JI-005 electric mini car cabin scooter. There's another one that's called E Colo E T4 Cruise. Um, and then there's another one that's called a FS C E T4 enclosed mobility scooter. And the last one that I found it's called a Q Pod 2 electric transport cabin scooter. Um, again, these are all the same scooter, they just have different names. Um, let me see. So, um, the websites that I found, again, I had to run them through the Better Business Bureau. Um, so these are the six that checked out and are, like, legit companies. Um, the first one I found, it's called MDS Medical, uh, Department Store. Another one, it's called, these are all websites again, by the way. Another one is called Go Mobility. Another one is called Electric Bike. Another one is called 
um, Mobility Paradise. And another website, it's the Green Transporters, the one that I talked to. And then the last one that I found is called Electric Whispering. So I called all these companies, and like I said, they're all checked out. They're legit companies. They're real. Um, the issue that I was having was they didn't have any in stock. Um, now, because of COVID and, like, everything that was happening, like, with the ports and everything, again, this is being shipped from China. So it's, you know, a long ways. Um, it, a lot of stuff got like paused or they just weren't moving anything. So a lot of companies didn't have these in stock here in the U.S. Again, they had them in the factory in China, just not here, um, like in the factories. So, um, it took a long while to find one that actually had them. So at the end, I ended up going with, um, Electric Whispering Company. Um, the guy that I spoke to, his name is Dave, he's a really, really nice guy. He, um, let me know that they had five coming in. They weren't there yet, but they had five that were being shipped from China. Two were spoken for, so he only had three available, so if I wanted one, I needed to hop on it right away. So, the thing was, the original price, and the price that I saw in every other company, um, was $7,395. Um, because of the rise in port fees and, you know, just everything going up, cost of living, everything going way, way up, the price went up for this scooter as well. Um, the price that they gave me was 9995 And yes, that's very expensive, but like I said, I needed this scooter. So, um, thanks to, like I said, I did a fundraiser, we were able to raise the money. Um, so we bought it for the $9,995. Um, and after a while, um, the guy told me that he called the green transporters company in China and let them know, you know what, I'm having a hard time selling the scooters that we have left over because they're so expensive. Like, it's very hard for the average person to be able to afford something like this. So they agreed and they knocked off $1,000. So since we had already paid the $9,995, they went ahead and reimbursed us $1,000. So that was nice. Um, but what I was going to say, it took four months after we ordered and paid for it for it to arrive to my house. So it takes a while, um, but it did get here. Um, what was another thing I was going to say? Um, oh, yes. There's a lot of people that were reaching out to me and letting me know that they were able to find this scooter somewhere else or at a different website for a lot cheaper. Yes, you can find this a lot cheaper. Like, um, I think they said on Ali, Alibaba, you can find it for like five grand. But that does not include shipping. If you try to order something like this and pay by yourself with shipping, it's like three to four grand. So, yes, we paid a lot of money. We pay, ended up paying... 8895 but that included shipping. We didn't have to do anything. That was the total price for everything. So that's how much I got my scooter for. Um, again, if you guys have any more questions, feel free to ask. Um, but yeah, hopefully this does help somebody out there that, you know, truly does need this. And um, like I said, my goal of making these videos is to spread awareness that there's things out here for, you know, disabled people, elderly people, visually handicapped people. There's stuff out there that can help you guys. So I hope, you know, you guys got some good information and yeah. <laughs>